Brought to you by wikivd.com Liver Bird The liver bird is the symbol of the English city of Liverpool. It is normally represented as a cormorant and appears as such on the city's arms, in which it bears a branch of lava seaweed in its beak as a further pun on the name Liverpool. History King John founded the Borough of Liverpool by Royal Charter in 1207. The Borough's second charter, granted by Henri III in 1229 gave the town's people the right to form a guild, with the privileges this came with including the right to use a common seal. Liverpool's ancient seal probably dated from this time though the earliest surviving impression is from 1352, the seal depicted a generic bird with a plant sprig in its beak together, with a scroll inscribed J-O-H-I-S an abbreviation for Johannes Latin IV of John. The bird was almost certainly intended to be an eagle the symbol of John the Evangelist, who was both the namesake and the patron saint of King John. The plant sprig is interpreted as Bruma badge of the Plantagenet dynasty. Also visible on the seal is a star and crescent, one of King John's personal badges. However, the shoddy draftsmanship of the seal has given rise to other theories. Richard Brook, a 19th-century Liverpudlian antiquary, surmised that the bird was a dove with an olive branch, and that the scroll read Nobis of Eobis. By the 17th century, the bird's real identity had been forgotten, it began to be interpreted either as a cormorant, a common bird in the area, or as a lever. In 1611 the municipal records described the male receiving a plate marked with a cormorant. The town's arms while in in 1668 the Earl of Derby gifted the town a silver gilt maze engraved with a lever. In his 1688 work The Academy of Almory, Randleholm records the arms of Liverpool as a blue lever upon a silver field. Home takes this word to be an adaptation of the German Loffler a Dutch Leffler, Leffler, both referring to the spoon bill. It is possible that these continental words were adopted for the bird in Liverpool's arms as they made a fitting allusion to the name Liverpool. Here around the same time the broom sprig in the bird's beak was reinterpreted as a branch of lava. Also on account of the similarity of the word to the city's name. In August 1796 Mayor Clayton Tarleton wrote to the College of Arms to request an official grant of arms to the city. His letter called the bird a lever, or sea cormorant. Arms were duly granted on the 22nd of March 1797 by Sir Isaac Hurd Garter King of Arms and George Harrison, Norroy King of Arms. However, the grant described the bird only as a cormorant. In addition to the arms and crest garter granted supporters on the 23rd of March, these consist of Neptune, the god of the sea, and his son, and Herald Triton. The motto is Deus Nobis Haecotia Facet, a quotation from Virgil's Eclogues translating to God hath granted us this Caesar God has bestowed these blessings upon us. Representations in the city Representations of the bird can be found throughout Liverpool. The two most famous stand atop the clock towers of the Royal Liver Building. At Liverpool's pier head overlooking the Mersey, the building headquarters to the Royal Liver Assurance was opened in 1911. The metal cormorant-like birds were designed by Carl Bernard Bartels and constructed by the Bromsgrove Guild. There are two less well-known liver birds in the city. A third metal bird is on the nearby Mersey Chambers office building adjacent to the Church of Our Lady and St. Nicholas, the parish church of the city of Liverpool. The fourth, a bird carved in stone topped the original St. John's Market building until its demolition in 1964. The stone liver bird is now displayed at the Museum of Liverpool. Though nowadays the bird is inseparable in the public mind with Liverpool Football Club. The first club to use it as a symbol was in fact Everton. 
It was replaced in the 1930s with Prince Rupert's Tower and other Liverpudlian icon. Some fans believe it should be reinstated, arguing that as a symbol of the whole city it rightfully belongs to both clubs. Modern Myths and Popular Culture The modern popularity of the symbol largely dates to 1911 when the Liver Building was built. This prominent display of two liver birds rekindled the idea that the liver was a mythical bird that once haunted the local shoreline. According to popular legend they are a male and female pair, the female looking out to sea watching for the seamen to return safely home, and the male looking into the city watching over the seamen's families. Local legend also holds that the birds face away from each other as if were they to mate and fly away the city would cease to exist. In fact they were indeed designed to watch the city and the sea. Another popular story that told about them is that they are chained down as if they were to fly away the river Mersey would burst its banks and flood the city of Liverpool. This is somewhat similar to the mating story. An all-female rock group from Liverpool called the Liverbirds was active in the 60s. They moved to Hamburg in 1964 where they were billed as Die Weibleich and Beatles. During the 1970s, the Liverbirds was the name of a popular British sitcom dealing with two young women in Liverpool. A play on the British slang term bird meaning a young woman. The crest of Sir Paul McCartney is a calling liver bird holding a guitar in reference to his profession and native city. Trademark In November 2008 Liverpool Football Club attempted to trademark the version of the liver bird shown on the club badge to stop false club merchandise. The deputy council leader Flo Lucas responded that the liver bird belongs to all the people of Liverpool and not one company or organisation. Liverpool FC finally trademarked the liver bird in September 2010 after coming to an agreement with the City Council. Liverpool FC trademarked it with the European Trademark Office, and the Council filed a trademark with the British Intellectual Property Office. This was done to protect its use by companies in Liverpool but also for the football club to protect itself against counterfeit products. Brought to you by Wikivd.com Would you like to know more?